Hey, Dr. Fred! We have to do something! What do you suggest, college boy? No diamond for the central unit, no power for the chronogons! A mutant monster of my own creation, roaming the countryside, taking over the world! It's a dark day for mad science! Why can't we just fix the time machine? It needs a whole new diamond! Now where am I going to get the money? How much could it possibly cost? Two million dollars! So, you've got money, don't you? Well, I didn't get all the money I expected from that TV show about us. We had to rent out our mansion as a hotel just to make ends meet. Ah. <sighs> If only I had signed that contract in time! What TV show about you? Well, after that incident where I was possessed by a meteor from outer space, somebody decided to make a show about us, but they didn't pay us anything. All we got was a cut of the video game. Wow, that thing made millions. Yes, I forgot to sign the royalty contract in time, though. I still have it in my safe upstairs. Let's go get the contract out of the safe and sign it. I forgot the combination. But that's... that's so stupid, Dr. Fred. I know. It gives my enormous brain nightmares. Every night I dream about opening the safe, but I find something horrible inside and slam it shut! Over and over again, night after night! Is that why you drink so much coffee? I haven't slept in two years! You're going to get really chafed hands doing that. Sorry, coffee jitters. Maybe you should switch to decaf. No! Then I'd fall asleep and the dreams would come. How's the mad scientist biz? Not too lucrative lately. We're living mostly on the income from renting out our mansion. That and Edna's tips from her exotic dancing. Well, gotta go save the world. Good luck! I don't have time for that now. I'm on a mission. I'd rather not. Gee, Dr. Fred doesn't have a penny. I've never gotten over my childhood fear of Uzo. I'd rather not. I hate that clown. The voice of Uzo in a box. Hey boy, you missed the party! You and the clown were having a party? No, no, last night! At the Novelty Goods Salesman's Convention. I tell you, we Novelty Goods Salesmen know how to have a good time. Has anyone ever told you you look like Don Corleone? That's strange. My wife says I look like Charles Lawton. So, want a cigar? Sure, lay one of those Havanan babies on me. Thought I was gonna blow your head off there, didn't you? Well, you were right!
You shouldn't smoke, it's a bad habit. That cracks me up every time. It looks almost real. It's covered with unrecognizable, useless junk. And a gun. Hands off, boy! That's a precision-made novelty device. Hmm, air conditioning, I guess. Looks like they all escaped. Disgusting. I don't think I can pick that up, jumpy little sucker. Actually, I'd call this more of a freak. Hmm, brown water. I think I could lubricate my car with this stuff. My, what a big coffee maker. The Duke Memorial Brand Microwave. Who knows what surprises await inside? It's a fine funnel. It looks pretty broken. It's a coin-operated clothes dryer. attached to a rotating shaft which transmits and modifies rotary motion and torque. It's locked. Looks like a stand for tourist info and ads for local merchants. Hey, Ted. Talkative as ever, eh, Ted? Boy, I haven't seen you since I was here five years ago. You haven't changed a whole lot. You know, I bet you'd really like my friend Hoagie. He's a roadie for a heavy metal band. Boy, I wish I had as little on my mind as you do. No offense intended, of course. Well, I'd best be on about saving the world. It's closed. It's empty. Hi. Don't sneak up on me like that. What are you up to? Uh, I uh, locked my keys in the car. I don't see your keys in the car. Uh, actually, I lost them somewhere. If you're locked out, why break into the trunk? I uh, have a spare set of keys in there. Nice crowbar. Thanks. Don't even think about asking to use it. I need it. See you later. 
Yeah. It's really dirty. It's pretty darn cold. Mmm, that buzzing fluorescent light makes the beef jerky look especially attractive. There's a whole lot of keys on here. This beautiful 4,000 carat diamond can be yours today for the special rock bottom introductory price of $2 million. The number to call is 1-800-STAR-WARS. Don't miss this amazing once in a lifetime opportunity. Up too late? Try a fickle finger's fate. Stick in a dime and you'll have a good time. My grandma gave me one like this for my birthday. Sleek design, sturdy construction, attractive housing, all in all a fine phone. Couch Potato Shopping Channel, Wanda speaking. Um, uh, I want to buy a diamond. That will be two million dollars. Do you have a major credit card? Um, I have a numbered Swiss bank account. What's the number, sir? Um, it's 846-427-35327. I'm sorry, the Credotron shows that account to be empty.